Hey, Freddie Servant here. Welcome back to another YouTube video. In this video, I'm going to be talking about musicians' insurance. As a working musician, your music isn't just your life, it's your business. You're likely booking gigs, going from venue to venue. And if you haven't thought about the liabilities that come up with booking gigs, you could potentially be setting yourself up for some hefty out-of-pocket cost. Just like the old adage says, prepare for the worst and hope for the best. So in this video, I'm gonna go over what's covered under a musician's insurance policy and some examples on why you may need musician's insurance. And then I'm gonna give you my recommendation on where you could go to get a musician's insurance policy. But before we do that, if you wouldn't mind giving this video a quick like as it really helps to push this content out to other working musicians. So the first coverage covered under a musician's insurance policy is going to be general liability. And that's gonna protect you from third party bodily injury and property damage. Say for instance, you're playing a show and a fan jumps on stage and runs towards you and you dodge, causing them to slip, trip, and fall and break an arm. Even though it's not your fault, you could be taken to court for a bodily injury claim and on the hook for costly medical bills and court fees. Or let's say you were hired to play a private philanthropist charity event and you accidentally spill your drink with your guitar and it spills all over an expensive couch. Now it's ruined and you're on the hook for either a cleaning or an entire replacement. Another coverage included inside of a musician's insurance policy is professional liability, also known as errors and omissions. So let's say you were hired to play at an event and the event and show is centered around you and your performance and days leading up to the event, your schedule changes and you're forced to cancel. So many tickets get refunded and many additional seats go unsold. And so the client sues you for negligence, being that the cancellation resulted in a hefty financial loss. Now, other coverages that are gonna be included in your musician insurance policy that center around your live performance are gonna be performance property protection. This is gonna cover musical instruments or equipment that you use that you don't own. Also, business equipment coverage. This is gonna cover musical instruments or equipment that you do own. How much a musician's insurance policy is going to cost is going to depend on several different factors factors, including the size of your crew, how long you're going to need coverage for, and the amount of coverage that you are required to have. Many working musicians can't rely on a basic homeowner's or renter's insurance policy to cover their risk. You are going to need a specialized musician's insurance policy tailored for your needs and specific risk. This way, the show can go on. So at the beginning of this video, I promised that I would give you my recommendation on where you could go to get a musician's insurance policy. The next steps to coverage is as simple as a few clicks below.